Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got an exciting tutorial for you. We're going to explore the world of animations right here in Canva. It's an easy way to add that extra flair to your designs. So, let's not waste any time and jump into the step-by-step -step guide. Step 1. Open your browser and head straight to Canva. Once you're on your homepage, open the template or project where you want to add some animation magic. Now step 2. Within your project, click on the element or text to which you want to add animation. This could be anything from a logo to a piece of text. Click on the animation button at the top. Step 3. This is where the fun begins. Explore the various animation options available to you. Canva provides a range of animations to suit different styles and vibes. Step 4. Choose an animation that resonates with your design vision. From subtle fades to dynamic bounces, there's something for every taste. Customize the animation settings as needed to align with your creative vision. Before finalizing Step 5, make sure to preview your animation. This gives you a chance to see how it flows within your project. Adjust any settings if necessary to achieve the desired effect. Feel free to get creative. Step 6. You can add multiple animations to different elements within your project. This can really make your design pop and grab attention. As we approach the final step, step 7, take a moment to fine-tune and perfect your animations. Ensure that everything is synchronized and flows seamlessly. This attention to detail will make your design stand out. Now the moment we've all been waiting for, step 8, download your animated masterpiece. Canva makes it easy to save your project in various formats. Choose the one that suits your needs, and you're ready to share your animated creation with the world. And there you have it, guys. Creating animations in Canva is a breeze, and it can add that wow factor to your designs. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for more Canva tips, and let me know in the comments what other design tricks you'd like to explore. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.